Scripture meditation. After each portion of scripture is read, spend time to meditate and reflect on it. Radical consecration. Ephesians chapter five, verses twenty-five to twenty-seven. Christ loved the church and gave Himself up for her. That he might sanctify her, having cleansed her by the washing of water with the word, so that he might present the church to himself in splendor, without spot or wrinkle, or any such thing, that she might be holy, and without blemish. First Thessalonians chapter four, verses seven and eight: For God has not called us for impurity, but in holiness. Therefore, whoever disregards this, disregards not man, but God, who gives His Holy Spirit to you. Luke chapter twenty-one, verses thirty-four to thirty-six. Take heed to yourselves, lest your hearts be weighed down with carousing, drunkenness, and cares of this life, and that day come on you unexpectedly, for it will come as a snare on all those who dwell on the face of the whole earth. Watch therefore, and pray always. That you may be counted worthy to escape all these things that will come to pass, and to stand before the Son of Man. Second Thessalonians chapter one, verses eleven and twelve. Therefore, we also pray always for you, that our God would count you worthy of this calling, and fulfill all the good pleasure of His goodness and the work of faith with power, 
that the name of our Lord Jesus Christ may be glorified in you, and you in Him, according to the grace of our God and the Lord Jesus Christ. Romans chapter 12, verses 1 and 2. I appeal to you, therefore, brothers, by the mercies of God, to present your bodies as a living sacrifice, holy and acceptable to God, which is your spiritual worship. Do not be conformed to this world, but be transformed by the renewal of your mind, that by testing you may discern what is the will of God, what is good and acceptable and perfect. Joshua chapter 3 verse 5 Consecrate yourselves, for tomorrow the Lord will do miracles among you.